2K19 leaks, rumors, are they true? And if so, should the 2K community be happy? You want to play devil's advocate? Let's do it. Let's say let's say the, let's say the rumors are true. Okay. Let's what do you want to start? You want to start with the rec center? Let's start with the Jordan rec center. Okay. If it's true, should the 2K community be happy? I think they should. Why? Because they've been asking for it since 2K16. They, you, I know you've seen the posts on Twitter tagging Ronnie, tagging Mike Wayne. Oh, please bring the Jordan Rex Center back. So let's just say that it is back. Okay. I think people are going to be happy because now, you know, people get that old quote unquote 2K15 feel just with a 2K19, you know, look in detail. Okay, well now what happens? What happens if, if people are not happy? What do you do? What do we do then? What, what, what if the 2K community. What happens if it backfires? What happens if people actually realize the Jordan Rec Center is nothing but pro am? Yeah, I mean, walk nothing on. but walk on with regular clothes. What ha what happens when people back? What happens if it backfires? What happens if people say y'all should have been bought the Jordan Rex Center back? What happens? But then? it's not up to the expectations, right? Um, what happens then? I mean, at that point, I think you should listen to the community. Maybe take a poll and ask them. You know, what do you guys want? Like. Try to make a try to make an adjustment. Whether if that you know if it have to disable the rec center for a little bit, so you get all of that together, you know, to give them what they want. But at the same time, though, they're going to need actual constructive criticism, not just people just yelling at them saying, "Oh, y'all need to do this, y'all need to do that." But like saying how you can do it. Can I say what one of my biggest it? fears for the Jordan Rec Center? Go ahead. And keep it real. 2K has, has 2K has had problems with three on three connections and two on two connections in 2K18. 2K18 first drop, what was we dealing with? Uh, frame drop. And that was on the basic PS4, right? Mm -hmm. And also people lagging out too. And lagging out and and delaying. Mm -hmm. Now what happens in a let's say let's say the Jordan Rex Center is not like Walk On. Let's say the Jordan Rex Center is actually it has four or five courts, all five v five. That's a lot. Of, that's a that's lot of people on one server. Connections. Yeah, five v five. That's a lot. You think they'll do dedicated service? I'm I'm pretty sure 2K already has dedicated service. There's no way that they're running 2K without dedicated service. They're already doing that. That's the reason why delaying is such a huge thing because right. they're actually hacking. Because you delayed a whole server. Yes, right. you're actually hacking into the servers themselves. Right. So my thing is, what if the Jordan Rex Center? What if the servers are bad? Well, we because always, we already know on release day, it, you know. It's going to be Oh, I'm already expecting yeah. release day. I'm already expecting the, con the, service, the be connection unplayable. to be bad. But I'm saying, what if the connection is not as good as it should be? That's my thing because I'm, I'm wondering. Because when you played in 2K17 and 16, if you remember, 4's connection was terrible. 4's connection, yeah, the 4's court hit was, was hit or miss. Sometimes it would be good, but the majority of the time, Sometimes, it was Most of the time, you couldn't even get to the board. Like, so, so now it's like, I, I wonder. Because this Jordan Rex Center is such a big deal to people. Again, I, I I apologize. I never played 15, so I don't. I never really. I haven't seen the the hype about it. I never I haven't seen the hype about it. Mm -hmm. And again, I remember people saying. Um, I've seen a couple of YouTube videos where people say the Jordan Rex Center wasn't really all of that. Like it was cool, but y'all didn't really play it as much as y'all try to make it seem. But then you got the younger people saying. The Rex Center was the best thing ever, as if Park didn't exist. Right. I, now, again, I never played 15, so I missed that shot completely, bro. I'm <laughs> so I'm so off, but I'm, I'm gonna get my game right back. No, you um, oh, you put me in a horrible. Let's spot. talk. Let's talk. Let's talk about the let's. Uh, I let's mean, talk about the playground. Let's talk about the playground. Do you think it's back? From the leaked footage, like we said, we're playing we're playing what if game. From the leaked footage, the playground is back. Oh. Are people happy that the playground is back? I don't think they because, are. Because, again, we knew that this was coming. Facts. We knew that this was coming. We knew the playground was going to be back. So when people try to act surprised and they see the leaked footage, now... Right, like, how you how do you get mad that you go from the neighborhood and you expect them to bring back three parks? Like, come on, right. now. Let's be realistic here. Like, like they're not going to just change what they're doing. Bro, they put a lot of hard work right. into this playground. Now, I know that 2K18 was nothing but a beta. 2K18 was a beta. We could clearly all see that 2K18 was, was a beta. So with 2K18 being a beta, my thing is, is for the playground, I'm expecting a lot. Me personally, I'm not upset at the playground because I know that the, the set, every time they come out, like, like 16, 16's, you know, um, uh, I mean 17, 17's whole like, the parks and everything, 
the connection on on 18 is is much better than what it was on 16. Mm -hmm. I mean on 17. Definitely. But you know, like the gameplay was a lot smoother. On, the the gameplay was a lot smoother on 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 uh, on, on 18. It's just that uh, not having rewards, uh, uh, pure stretches being OP is what kind of killed the game. Now fast forward that we already know that. I'm only talking about the stuff that to me that's important. Right now, 2K19 is coming out with the playground again. Accept it for what it is. But my thing is, is will you be okay? If if, if, if 2K19 comes out with the if 2K19, you are a dirt bag. I almost made that too. You are. A dirt bag. I almost that made a, that. That was a fire shot though. If 2K19's playground, oh, if they, uh, I won. Wow. We lost that. If 2K19's playground stays up to date. They're always patching it. They're always adding new stuff. Will you be happy? I mean, at the same time, no. You, you can't be for sure. You can say you can honestly say no because you know you can't please everybody. So you but can have you all it though? is, but but you know somebody's gonna complain about something. Okay. Play the play play devil's advocate. Play the people that'll be upset about it. Okay. Play the person to be upset about it. That playground is back. Yes, that playground is back. Play the people I want that three parts. I want Raven, Sunset, and Old Town. Okay. That's what we've that's what we've done for three years now. Okay. I want three parts back because it's like I don't want to just. I just knocked my own shot in. That <laughs> just made me mad, bro. I don't want to just play in a random neighborhood. I want to actually have a rival day. I want to have three parks. I want to. Wow. I want to remember what it was like. I was going to take this shot, brother. You wow, you're a dirtbag. You might as well just pass that shot out. I mean, me personally, I was a rough rider. So I want to go back to being at Rivet. You know what I'm saying? Put on for my rough rider. Is it that... Okay. Yes, it is. Okay, hold on. So if they bring back the crews, if they bring back crews, I mean, not the crews, but the, but the affiliations. If they bring back affiliations, will you finally be satisfied? Yes. So, so, so say... Okay, I need, no, not in the neighborhood. no park. No. I mean, no parks. Affiliations, but no parks. No. You can't have Rivet, Old Town, and Sunset and not have three different But parts. people are acting like this is not already coming. Like, we already knew the playground was going to make it into another year. Oh, wow. We knew that this was coming. So why is it that people are pretending like they didn't know that the playground was not coming? The playground was going to be set. Ronnie had already announced it. Even when you look at the, the, the um, the, I think it's the, um, the 2K19, when they finally talked about uh, 2K19 and stuff, and they were talking about the LeBron James edition, mm -hmm. they had already announced the playground. It was already announced. It was like it was already in that little package deal. You seen that the playground was coming. So why is it that people are acting like this? The, the playground is such a, a, a like a they better not add the playground back. They better not, bro. We knew it was coming. So so how do you? See, all right, we know it's here. How do we? How do? How does two K satisfy you? How how does two K satisfy people that want par three different parks back? Even though I feel the playground is a great idea, it's easier on servers. Mm -hmm. It's easier for them to maintain connections. It's easier for them to fix issues, like say you can't get to the park, or you're struggling to get to the park, or you keep lagging out, or, or, or anything. Like in, in, in 2K17, when we played, when, if I could not go to Sunset at all. Yeah, I couldn't either. I couldn't go to Sunset. So it kept lagging me out. And then at one point, I couldn't even play at Ribbit. Then Old Town became unplayable. So it's like, you can't satisfy everyone. But my thing is, how do you make those people happy that want three different parks, you know what I'm saying, and don't want the playground? How do you make them happy? If I'm not going to, if I'm not traveling to another park, there's no point in me even playing 2K. I just feel like there's so much more to do when you only have one park to maintain. When you only have one, when you only have, we are ass right now. <laughs> When you when we when you only have one park to maintain, all you have to do is add different themes, different. I mean, how hard is it to add park after dark in in that park where everybody we suck? How hard is it to add park after dark so that everybody can experience it? Not that we have to travel to a park, but you make the whole park one park, park after dark, but so that it's 2K, a clean you know connection. Be, but that's what I'm saying. Again, going to park after dark, they had to go from. They're running three different parks. They're running. They're running a venue. They're running stage and pro. That's the reason why I park at the dark stop. So now cancel that. Now you're just saying, okay, all there is 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 one playground. How hard is that? It should. We should have all types of special events. We should have a bunch of special events now, especially in the play playground because there's so many things 
that they can that they can mess around with and do with just having one playground. We should, but at the same time, knowing 2K, we already know that connection is going to be the biggest problem. It's going to be the biggest biggest issue. I do. Did you just miss the ball completely, bro? All right. Let's talk about let's talk about some of uh, let's talk about some of the uh, okay archetypes. Now, we've been seeing a bunch of nonsense. Some people saying that there's triple archetypes. Mm -hmm. Some people saying that there's percentage, that there's archetypes, percentage now. archetypes. Now, look, I believe that 2K, this is off my opinion. There's only going to be dual archetypes. Let me tell you why. If they were to try to make triple archetypes, do you know how many broken archetypes there would be? In 2K, there's already broken archetypes as it is. Justin, you don't play sharpshooter dunks like a slasher. Ex yeah. He shoots mid ranges like a shot creator. And leans and face So imagine, imagine having, imagine that's a that's just the cleanest shot I could possibly get. Imagine having a playmaking, sharp shooting, shot creator. That'd be or ridiculous. A playmaking, sharp shooting slasher. You'd have the ability. You said playmaking sharp shooting. Sharp shooting slash. You'd have the ability to shoot limitless range threes because I'm pretty sure your badges would be yep. like silver. You'd have dunking badges. Yep. You'd pretty much be a demi guy built from 2K16. And that 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 right that because that'd play, be ridiculous. Play sharps can already shoot mid ranges, so it's not like a play sharp can't shoot midis. So it's like you're you're technically you're already breaking. That's a. <laughs> that's the reason why I say. 2K19 is not going to be triple archetypes. I'm pretty sure it's not because that would be a lot of coding and, and oh trial God. and error for them. That, that they do that not have time. Horrible. They just don't to, have time for that. To have a to have a slashing, sharp shooting lockdown. Yep. Ain't nobody scoring. Ain't nobody scoring. You're not scoring on that build. That build is also, be you know, Mike Williams was saying that the defense is going to be better. Right. So that'd be ridiculous. Like you literally are not getting past him. Oh, I'm about to quit. I'm about to quit. We finna we I'm about to quit. <laughs> I'm about to quit. I'm not playing. I'm about to quit. Like, I'm at a point I'm at a point where when I look at when I look at 2K, all I see is is <laughs> I see a, a a big old blur. A blur. I can't tell like like when I look at when I think about other games like Battlefield 5. I look at, <gasps> even when I look at NBA Live, I know where NBA Live is going. Mm -hmm. I know where NBA Live is going now. I can see it. It's like it's 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 clear as day. NBA Live is trying to move in this direction of oh, let's just make it to where it's like NBA Street again, where you beat teams and then you pick up players after that. Now they're adding all, all these like special venues, um, like the the France courts and stuff. Mm -hmm. I see where they're going with NBA Live. I mean with NBA 2K. I don't know. What to expect at all? 2K is kind of like going around with the, like a chicken with their hair cut off. It, it it really is, and then it's like, dude, 2K is one of the best companies at hiding information. Facts. When you you want to talk about a company that can hide information, that information is, is confidential. Fa and they haven't showed gameplay, so right now I think that every fan we ain't even got bootleg gameplay yet. Facts. We ain't even got bootleg gameplay. I think every fan is just on edge. So now we're taking rumors. We're not even a hundred percent sure oh my. if they're. We're not hundred percent sure if the rumors are true. Just taking rumors and just right. running with it. We just don't know now because 2K is not telling us anything. And it's like you can't you can't really be upset because I know. It, all right, let's say let's say if somebody did leak those rumors, right? Let's say they did leak them, right? I don't blame the person for leaking because essentially, the, the I blame the fans person are getting for bro, fans are getting antsy. Like fans are getting very very antsy. Like yeah, as a two K fan, it's July, right? I'm getting tired of waiting. I'm getting tired of sitting on the sidelines and I'm waiting for two K to drop something. Just drop something to show us oh, wow. something real. And we can't even get that from 2K. And now I'm at a point where it's just like I'm getting antsy. So it's like I'm going to believe anything that I see now. I don't care if it's on Reddit. I don't even care if it's at the barbershop. It could be by a homeless man. A homeless man can tell me that 2K, it, 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 2K is about to have aliens. I'm, I'm going to believe them because at this point. We're not getting anything. Right. So it's like what do we do? What do, what do we do? We believe in it, and we believe in it, and the stuff that we're hearing, are we happy? Are you really happy to hear that there's, that there's Jordan Rex in it? 
I mean, I think a lot of people are going to be happy about the Jordan Rec Center, and stage is not going to be played as much as it is. I don't think it is either. I don't think, like, the first day, I will not, bro, the first week, people are not going to be in stage. Well, you're going to have the, those those stage heads in there. Wow, that was my shot. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. You're going to have them stage heads in there, but the real people that have been looking forward to, rec, to the Rec Center, they're going to be in Rec Center 24-7. 24-7. I just figure if that man is on fire. I'm right on now. fire right now. But I just figure if you're gonna have the Jordan Rex Center, it's gotta be amazing. Everything that you up Oh my goodness. Every single thing that you upload for the Jordan Rex Center needs to be amazing. Yeah, it has to be it has to be it has to exceed everybody's expectations. The the connection the connection needs to be amazing. The the feel needs to be amazing. The the day day three, day day four Y'all need to make sure that we can get in there. We can step on dots. There, there's no, there's no lagging out. Like, because it just seems like every little thing triggers two K players. Everything online, triggers two K I mean, players. Y'all on thin right ice right now, especially with the Rex Center coming back. Y'all on thin ice. Y'all really are. Y'all on thin, thin ice. Really. I'm this just hoping 2K, that everything two, is amazing. The rec center has to go according to plan with no mistakes off rip. If in the first two days, if there's anything going on, any bugs, it needs to be patched. This how know. This how you know I'm antsy. I'm over here in every shot talking about the Jordan rec center right now because even I'm antsy, man. Like I just, I just want a game that's. I just want 2K to be amazing. Like I want 2K to just to have a feel like that. That that it's like. What happened to the little cutscene? Boy, I just killed this table. Sure did. That's it. That's it, man. That's all I want, Jay. I just want 2K to be amazing again. I want it to be amazing again. I, I'm, I'm ready for 2K. Got to be on the A game. This, this, this coming to 2K. Y'all got to be talking to the community, doing updates. Real niggas on my team, y'all. Freddy Wap left side, can't see y'all. Can't be y'all. Nigga, my whole squad ready to ride, riding round, but be ready to die. Y'all don't gotta decide whether or not you approve of this. You ain't gotta make room for this. I Bermuda shit, bring it down. Can you hear me now? You couldn't relate. I bet they all feel me now. The rulers.